Shayla, move on. <laughs> Is Shayla doing the slide deck? Yes. Oh my gosh, I thought it was Patrick. <laughs> now this makes sense. Excited for you guys to be here for Root University. Don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe. So this, we're talking about reversal of aging, which we started with. Um, I have to say, Jayla and Tiger worked a lot on these slides. And for some reason, and I have no idea why, because they're in their 20s, they're worried as much about aging as I am. But most of the women on this show will understand that. So this study talks about collagen and reverse aging effects of collagen, which I know everyone loves to hear. Um, it was a meta-analysis. I say this a lot when I do talks with Dory. I love meta-analysis because it looks at different types of people in different studies. And this one had a total of 1,125 participants. Everyone be happy. It was between the ages of 20 and 70. So we will be addressing women of all ages in this. And they looked at the favorable results of hydrolyzed collagen supplements. And I want to say this. Um, I just want to just say one more time that we have some of the best collagen you can ever get anywhere. Um, and we made it in a way and in a process that I is proprietary and other people do not have. Um, based on the results of this meta-analysis, it was they were they ingested it for 90 days. Now I would argue you you'll see results like I said in 30 days, but it reduced the skin aging, it reduced wrinkles, and it improved the skin elasticity and hydration. So the before and after pictures were amazing after 90 days. So guys, take a picture before you do this. Take a picture at 30 days, take a picture at 60 days, take a picture of 90 days. I want to have some of you guys on stage in Cyprus and on university showing your pictures and talking about how this helped you. Um, the next one is reverse of aging of collagen. And it, it talks about uh, collagen peptides from bovine bone on skin age. And this was with mice. But if you look at this again, you're gonna see that they found in the study and they gave them anywhere, um, different dosing, 200, 400, 800. And they were the little mice, 13 month females. But if you look at the intake and what happened in the skin, they noticed regardless of dosing um, that they really saw quantitatively that it was doing much better as far as skin. And chronic, what I wanna add this, chronological age process. So guys, this particular ingredient, if it was sourced in the right way, was able to quantitatively and qualitatively, statistically, really combat the skin age. So your chronological age process basically was not as fast because of using this product. So, what, so it means slower aging. So what, what you're saying is there, there is chronological age, which is the time that we're here biological age is the time your body ages along your chronology yes so it's slowing down your actual biological aging process which the trinity on its own has been shown to decrease biological age very significantly as well so the combination would be great one non sequitur uh, and and you know what it's funny because non you can ask me and then i want to talk about something else performance why are my studies important Oh, my studies are important because the closest DNA to ours um, is mouse DNA. So when I worked on human monoclonal antibodies, we used murine, which is mouse DNA. So it's really important because you can do really great studies and see how that's impacting them. Um, and that's why a lot of times it's not just because they're mice and they're not significant at all. Um, in fact, Clayton knows this. There was a mouse that died in our bathroom and I cried for like four hours. I love little mice. I think they're so cute. And I just can't stand seeing anything die um but but mice are the best way to really see the response that you're going to get from an efficacy and safety perspective and of course sometimes they go on to beagles and, and apes and stuff like that but um i think it's really important to show that um you know this was looked at and they saw a significant difference in how people were doing because of the collagen and then of course now the colostrum and what's interesting is is the bovine colostrum um, it showed that it really helped with the different serum levels and it helped during training so that people were able to perform at a more effective right I and love higher to rate. What? I love to compete. That's right. Ted said he loves to compete. <laughs> so, um, 
And I know, you know, we've tried different things like whey protein and everything, but it's much better to do the collagen and colostrum than to use other things like that.